will see how to load the Kaggle data set into a Google, uh, Google Colab uh, by using Kaggle API instead of directly downloading the data sets from the Kaggle has those data sets can be huge and it is really difficult to maintain it uh, so we'll use Kaggle API to do that uh, first you need to install the Kaggle in your Google Colab uh, by using this command like most of it like is already installed in the in the Google Colab uh, just to verify just need to install it again that it already satisfied requirements is already satisfied the second step is you need to go to your Kaggle profile in profile sessions uh, you just need to go to your settings uh, and in API session you just need to download uh, the API that is create new token it downloads the file and that is uh, Kaggle JSON file over here that I already downloaded it uh, then the next step is you need to upload it in your Google Colab. This is the option uh, in upload file. Uh, uh, this is the file that I'm going to upload. Yeah, I have uploaded it. And then the third step is you need to make a directory. Here we are going to make a directory and that is Kaggle in your home directory mm. uh, for me it shows like it's already existed for you guys it might uh, say like uh, the file has been created and uh, then the third step is to copy the file that is Kaggle json file yeah. uh, in your home directory mm. I'll just copy this one yeah. Mm. yeah it's done and then the fourth step is to change the permissions of the file uh, that is to read and write mm. yeah, this is the file you just want to change your permissions yeah it has been done and then the fifth step is like if you want to see all the data sets that are available in the Kaggle uh, you just need to enter the data sets it just lists all the data sets that are, that are available yeah, you can see that these are the data sets that are available that are still not if you want you can just uh, type it, it you, know, you can just get the data set these are the references these are the titles uh, size it says everything yeah and then if you want to download the particular data set you just need to press the command that is Kaggle data sets and download and here you uh, the file that you want to download and uh, this is the file that I want to download yeah and like the vehicle data set mm. You can just download any file which is not shown. Uh, I can just go with this one yeah this is the vehicle data set file here you need to copy the file path name that is just this much that is the file name that is vehicle data set name and then the creator you just need to paste it over here and just press enter it it's downloading yeah uh, to see that whether it has downloaded you can just refresh it it shows yeah it has been downloaded this is the zip file you can just uh, unzip it uh, like there are some files like here you can see that you just want to download like particular csv file like here there are four like if you want to download just car.csv file you just need to uh, type i'll just copy this one mm, the F command and then the car data dot csv I think that's correct yeah this is the file and just press enter it starts to download the file yeah this is the file that has been downloaded that is just a csv file that is car data file now you can just unzip it 
Oh, it's already unzipped. Uh, there is no issue. Like, if you want to unzip this one, I'll just show you how to do it. Unzip icon. No. Yeah, it just unzips it. Yeah, here you can see that this is the unzipped file. It is CSV file over here. Now you can just view a data set by importing the library that is pandas uh, data see the data sets uh, of the car data set this is how you can use the Kaggle API to directly download the data set in your Google Colab instead of downloading the data set uh, from yeah yeah thank you uh, please like and subscribe thank you